up guys all right i'm going to be showing you how to make a really cool shank using some basic supplies a pen regular tape right or you can use stronger tape than this but you'd be using less tape if you would but this stuff does work as you can see needle bends a little so you're gonna have to readjust every time you stab something Alrighty then, and oh wait, I almost forgot one thing, safety pin, you're gonna need a safety pin, I found that these safety pins work a lot better than the needles do, alright then, I'm gonna restart with this pen, cause this is like, the best, you wanna use a short, not fat tube, alright then, there, take off that, ah, oh, dang, Stuff stuck in there. That's nice. Okay, this is t BS. Just gonna push it down in, and I'm gonna ow stab myself, there, man. There, I got it out. Alright, then. Now that I'm ready, let's do this. I'm gonna need a new needle. This one's kinda junk. You're gonna wanna unbend it like this one, though. Yeah, sorry if I sound a little sick, guys. I, I am sick. <sighs> Jeez. Alright, then. So, let's start. Bend your needle. To straight or as straight as you can possibly bend it. Looks pretty straight. How about you guys? Okay. Now that I'm done screwing around, let's do this. Take your needle. Piece of tape, form a circle with the tape, like that, it fell apart, hold on, like this, got your circle with the sticky part outside, not inside, then you're going to take the bottom half of your needle, do that, press it in, wrap the sides around it till it gets in that form right there. And then you can like set this aside. I'll tell you whenever you need the pen piece. Gonna take at least four pieces of tape. Careful with this part. Gonna take your needle. Get stabbed somewhat through the middle. Gonna take it all the way down to the circle part. Sticky part down. Wrap it in like a formation. Like a, a star or something. An X. But you don't all want the tape just going one way. Alright. I'd fast forward through this, but, you know, I'm just going to take it step by step. I'm not... Try not to get them stuck to the needle except for the part that goes through the center and about one more there that's about good take your pen not the part where you'd push the button in to make the pen part come out not that part 
Then you're gonna take your flower like needle. Say flower like because it looks like a flower to me. You'll shove the sticky end in first, needle last, and it's gonna stick in there. And then you're just gonna press down. You can even squeeze and just form that little circular shape there. Boom. You're like finished. It's pretty good. Remember the bending part though. The needle will bend. But that part you can help with like taking a piece of tape and wrapping it around the lower part of the needle and the pen. Like all together. Like somewhat like this somewhat like that you know just something there now we'll start to bend a lot less I do it this way though no. just like this then make the tape come out into a point here, and then you got your, like, needle. It's pretty sharp, too. I've already cut myself with it on accident. Not on purpose. I don't cut. Alrighty. See, I've got holes in my fingers. I doubt you can see it. There are holes in my fingers. There are, believe me. It's all because I've caught my finger, and it's, like, gone up into my finger there. But it is pretty sharp. Be careful with this. I'm pretty sure it won't get detected if you take it on a plane. Because I was reviewing some other videos and, you know, looking up stuff. And metal detectors cannot pick up stuff that small. Pretty sure, anyway. So you could take it on a plane, but, you know, not your, not your best idea. Alright then, see you guys. Nerf 88 out.